Hi there, Aries. Welcome. Welcome to your single love, future love tarot for the end of March 2023. I'm Tarot Heifer 11. This is a 10 card with extra info and bonus on where and how to find love. I love this reading. This is the singles love, future love. So let's relax, get some guidance. Please remember to take what resonates and leave the rest behind. Currently, why would Aries be single? The fool in reverse. Not being yourself. Um, contrary to the typical characteristics that you carry of, you know, being a risk taker. Here we see a singles Aries who is not willing to take a risk. For some reason, at the end of the day, Aries is tired from adventure and fun. Here is someone who can't even think of any reason why you would still be single. Or there's someone around you who's like, why are you single? You know what I mean? And what are we doing in order to find love? Trying to find love. Yes, someone is avoiding Aries, or you are avoiding them, avoiding the single scene kind of a thing. And then here we see justice in reverse. Someone isn't pretty enough. And this is avoid, avoid. So we have a lot of avoidance. And what are we doing? I mean, this is what, what, what are we doing as a singles Aries to find love at the end of March 2023 is we are totally avoiding it. Avoiding someone, someone avoiding us. If you feel that vibe, let me know down below in the comment box. That's what it's for. Steer me in the right direction. Four of Cups in reverse. They will be reluctant to open their heart to you. And the hermit, even like, tell their doctor, um, tell their boss, somebody here, uh, telling their co-workers, their shrink, their therapist. Yet while this is where to find love, when... Aries uh, graduates, completes the course. When someone graduates, completes the course. Sell your soul. Sell your soul. Wow. When you realize that this course of action is what can make or break your search for love. I see the advice here is for change. The advice, change. Someone humiliated. Okay. Um, we see the first impression is either I'm not pretty enough or they aren't good looking enough so be ready for that um it's 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 a disappointment here we see that disappointment you both are insecure selfish and then i see maybe both are in therapy here uh, here it is. Emotionally unavailable. So we are, and this is what we have in common, is that we are both emotionally unavailable. So you will have this in common with someone, uh, namely a Pisces, someone with Venus in Pisces. Emotionally unavailable uh, to even try new things or someone new no this once again we 
what will happen is we will lose trust. They will lose trust. And someone needs to trust in this new person here. We need to trust in this. And they need to trust in you. All right, I'm going to clarify with a completely different deck. So why don't you, let's take a pause for the cause. Hit the like button. You can actually share a loving vibe today by doing so. It's completely anonymous. If you want to become a member, just hit the subscription button. You can always check for any other readings I've done for March 2023. This is if you're single and you are either feeling like you are not pretty enough to get out in the singles game. But here we see someone that you're going to share that very much in common with. Um, and where we can find love, probably, you know, at work, at some sort of a doctor's office, professional setting. This is something we have in common, just short of somebody, you know, maybe uh, finding that in, you know, with a doctor or a therapist. But that's what's going on. You see, we're going to lose trust. So clarify the devil spirit. Please, through the tarot for Aries. Why is the devil here? Okay. So, we are not ready to take and make any moves. Somebody has not got a libido. Um, this is not taking the steps. You know, um, not having the money. We don't want to, you know... So, were we going to sell our soul to the devil when we finish this course? Here we see someone who says in their material world with the ace of pentacles in reverse, not willing to take a step until I know for sure about something. And it has everything to do with someone's um, being insecure. It has to do with looks. Why is death here? Death. Someone is not embracing the change. Death in reverse. Death. It, it's a mirrored image. It's a mirrored image. This is Scorpio. This is sex. This is money. Turns me on. You know, if they don't have enough money and they're not good looking, somebody isn't even turned on. So I, I, I don't understand how Aries can be so impulsive, willing to take risks. And here we have a singles Aries who is not. I also see this energy where someone... Um, desires to get what they want when it comes to love. But something needs to change. We're not changing that. And then we see somebody who doesn't, absolutely just doesn't want to change. So very, very, very set in your ways could hinder finding a new love. All right. So with that eight of pentacles, what I really want to know here, spirit, please, is we just find someone who just doesn't. They don't have the skills. They don't have the money. They don't have the looks. And then we find out how someone really feels. Are they going to find out how you really feel? Um, finding out how we really feel. I see the moon. Light and bright in this transformation is calling on change. So, you know, somebody's, maybe, you know, somebody's looks can change. Money status can change. Why is the king of cups in reverse here? The eight of swords. Um... Yeah, just cutting it out, chopping heads left and right. 
Maybe somebody, you know, you've been on a dating site and you're just like, you keep scrolling. You're like, that's not the one. That's not the one. That's not the one. Right? And, or we've dated several different people and we're cutting that out because we find either something and then we're going to lose, like, they don't trust or you don't trust and total lack of trust when it comes to being single. Absolutely, guys. You both are insecure and selfish. Someone is both either in therapy or you guys both work together. This is emotionally unavailable to even try new things. Someone needs to trust in something new. So if you're desiring, why is the Four of Wands here? To be able to trust in something new. It's very frustrating. Okay, so, you know, we've got to calm down about this. <clears throat> this frustration and lack of self-confidence... This could be a reading that's screaming to talk to someone about that. Take the first step. Um, this could be screaming of, you know, someone new. It's hard. Do I, you know, are they, am I going to be good looking enough? Are they going to be good looking enough? And then opening that can of worms. It's very frustrating for someone. We're going to find out how we really feel. Okay, so we can turn that frown upside down, you know, slow our roll, be emotionally available, cut that out, take the first step to cut that negativity out and embrace that change. Someone very much resistant, very resistant. To open up our feelings. It's very frustrating. Here. Spirit calling through the tarot. For someone to. Be able to get. Get 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 back in your element. You know what I mean? Because you're Aries. You know. You've got personality. The willingness to take risks in life. You know you are. Very good looking. And for some reason, we have someone who doesn't feel like they are. And then if it's the other people, you're not finding someone who is good looking enough. Let me see, what is that? Uh, temperance. going to be some... Oh. Oh, I don't know what I'm thinking. The Sagittarius Energy. In reverse. So Venus and Sagittarius, you know, not wanting to take the risk, not gambling. If I want to go, I'll go. If I don't want to go, I'm not going to go. So let me know how this turns out, guys. Um, this does seem to be your energy, but again, you guys have everything in common in that aspect, in your feelings, the way that you feel. So wouldn't it be refreshing to meet someone who feels the same way about relationships, other people, that you do? Because that is something that we have coming in, the possibility. So we've got to cut out the negative, even though maybe we need to talk to somebody. But I think it's going to be when you are in your routine like you do wherever you go and whoever it is, be it work, be it at the hospital, be it at the doctors, be it at the therapist, you know what I mean, is where you can find love coming in, okay? I don't know. Hopefully this helps. All right. Again, check back really soon. Good luck. And until next time, shalom.